Good morning to, to both of you, Tom and Michael. How are you guys doing this morning? Doing great. Excellent. Great. Wonderful. Greetings from Toronto, Canada. Um, this movie is is just wonderful. I, I you know, honestly, I, I just was so engaged watching this. I wanted to go on forever, to be honest with you. But Michael, you know, I got to ask you, how did you hook up with Tom and then decide we were going to do this thing? Well, I met I met Tom. I met Tom through my girlfriend and family and introduced me to Tom. And then Tom, I was brought along to this play. Tom had written this one man play and it was about an hour long. And I just had this profound effect. I'm not a songwriter. I'm not from Nashville, as you know, by my accent. I'm a filmmaker from Belfast. <laughs> and not really, I was going to make a film about songwriting. Do you know what I mean? It made sense. But I, Tom opened himself up in a really vulnerable way about the creative process. And whether you're a filmmaker or a chef or a musician, something about that spoke to me. So that was on one level. Yeah. And then the selfish film part of me um, thought I could make this into a film and maybe we could do it in a, in a different way than just a traditional documentary. Right. Filming a lot of theater front. So that's where the germ of the idea came from. Yeah. And Tom, for you, um, you know, as I was watching it, I'm going, yeah, this had to have been a one man show. Like it, it so speaks to being on a stage. No problem. Something that you could tour around. But then watching this, I really honestly felt that you were talking to me and, and talking into that camera, breaking the fourth wall. I felt so it was so personal. I was looking around going. I, you know, I hope nobody's embarrassed by what he's telling me. Honestly, <laughs> what was this experience like for you to be able to take it from a stage and do this and speak to the camera so intimately? Well, I was doing it for you, Bonnie, honestly. It, I it's, feel it's, that, Tom, whole, I do. <laughs> the, the whole point of this is, you know, everybody has a story and every story is so important. And right. I have found through writing songs and the one-man performance, that when I tell my story, it reminds you of your story. And together we remember who we are, where we're from and to whom we, be we belong. That right. really is the whole point of it. So if you got that out of it, then it's like, it was, it was worth it. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, I'd never done anything like this before. Yeah. So honestly, we didn't, we had no idea what, what we were doing. We just, we had a, a general idea and we had a limited amount of time and a little bit of money and we just got some friends to help us. And Michael's creative vision is what you see. Yeah, oh, it's just beautiful. Um, Michael, for you, once you started, you know, to really get to know Tom, what surprised you about him? Well, first of all, it's no mean feat to talk for an hour on yeah. screen with, with like you have other scenes or you cut away. So there's something about Tom, which is extremely captivating. You know, he's a storyteller at heart, both through his songs and both verbally. So I just sort of put the camera in his face, in his face and, and he did the rest. But <laughs> what was so brilliant about this is Tom mentioned, we didn't sort of know what we were doing. We just had this crazy idea and there were no rules. Right. There was no telling that she had to do this. So there was an excitement in the process of we really just trusted our instincts and sort of were led by that. And that's the most exciting place for me to be in as a filmmaker. So when you have that and Tom, it was um, uh, a joy to make. Yeah, um, Tom, for you, you know, I, I love when you explain in the film too, the rules kind of, of of writing a song. I mean, there really are no rules and 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 you've given us so many amazing songs. Do you recall one or, you know, one that just flowed so easily and then you gave it to an artist, whether it was Tim McGraw or whoever, and then you hear those words coming out of that artist's uh, mouth. I can't imagine what that must feel like for you as a songwriter. Well, it, it, it is, there's some amazing moments, you know, when you write a song, when you first have the idea, when the verse comes together, when you kind of find the, the rhythm. Uh, but you, when you have created something and then, you know, somebody that you really admire, one of these artists puts their interpretation on it and you hear it being, being sung back to you, it's, 
it, it it's hard to describe it. It really takes your breath away. You never get tired of it. I, I've never had a song recorded by anybody that I just wasn't amazed. You know, I, I kind of give somebody an original and it comes back in a different form. So it's, it is a, it's a real, it's, it's a real joy. Yeah, I can't even imagine. And uh, no, not only are your fans going to get this beautiful film on Paramount Plus, but there's going to be a companion album coming out this week too. Can you tell us a little bit about that, Tom? Well, that's the only downside. The companion is uh, is actually me singing my songs. Oh, come on. The, <laughs> the, the, the good news is that I've got Miranda Lambert, Tim McGraw, Lady A, Chris Jansen, and Colin Ray all featuring with me on these songs. And they're their addition is uh, it's it's pretty heavenly. So it, it's it's honestly we're very excited about yeah. you know it coming out and people being able to hear you know kind of the original version of when I wrote the song. But then you hear these these great artists join with me. It's it's a thrill. It's a win win situation. And just to wrap oh, it up, right. Michael, are you now a big country music fan? Like you can't go back, right? <laughs> Uncle Buck, that's the only music I listen to. <laughs> <laughs> good answer. Good answer. Congratulations good answer. To, the, to the two of you. Thank you so much for your time today. This is like I said, Tom, it's just it's a beautiful film. And and you know, and if you do want to take it back on the road, come to Toronto. We've got great stages here. The two of you are most welcome. And uh I'll take you out for a beer at one of our Irish pubs. Okay, sound good? <laughs> All right, we're we're coming. Good stuff. We're coming Thanks, guys. Sure. Have a great day. Bye-bye. Thanks, Bonnie. All right, we are.